Vanina, that's another Yes, yes. We can stop. Shall we stop? It's okay for the song? Yeah. Okay. 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 Halina. Great, I'm ready to. And I think Atanasia is ready also. Okay, so. Uh, hello everybody, hello Atanasia, hello Ali Halina, I'm so happy to see you again. Uh, our live event is about cultural heritage. Uh, first of all, I want to make a brainstorming about this team. Uh, so I have created uh, just a class about uh, this team using the mathematics. <laughs> Uh, then after the brainstorming, we will present our presentation. Are you ready? We'll start by Halina, Atanasia, then me. Okay? For me, I have a story jumper created by my pupils about uh, our Tunisian heritage, uh, cultural heritage. Okay? Uh, so, uh, I have okay. yes. our meeting. So it's okay for our meeting. Is uh, I will uh, I will share uh, with you the cultural heritage. So I will share. I will stop the sharing. Then I will share. Okay, this is uh, the cultural uh, heritage, the brainstorming. So just you type, just you type amati.com. And you enter this code. Okay. Great. Great. Fifty nine, eighty five, forty seven. Fifty nine. 85 Maya man 
Then uh, we will enter our cultural uh, heritage like uh, you. Yes, yes, Oman. Try to enter your. Uh, for example, we will talk about festivals. Festivals? Yes, architecture. 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 Très bien. Then, uh, building. Sorry. Building, ma Building. Can we? Can we show our? So this is our brainstorming. Is it okay for Hanina and for Atanasia? It's okay. Yes. It's okay. Um, three, one, two, three, one, two. Okay. I think it's okay. I think it's okay. So, uh, this is our brainstorming about the cultural heritage. For me, my pupils will present uh, their. Uh, uh, their story about festivals, about Tunisian festivals, yes, yes, freedom, beauty, traditions, monuments, art, there are tangible and intangible uh, cultural heritage for each country, great, great, good, yes, yes, Atanasia, great. Okay. So we have eight participants in our brainstorming. Great. Okay. So I will stop sharing. So uh, I'll just make a uh, a screenshot of the brainstorming. And I will put it as uh, the background of our uh, live event. So I will change uh, the photo. Is it that? And this is our brainstorming as a photo. I make it as a particular photo of event. Okay. Yes. Okay, now we will move to our presentations. So, Hanina, please, can you present your uh, uh, your output for us about your cultural heritage? Okay. Hanina. Thank 
Yes, it's okay, Halina. Yes. Oh, yeah. Yes, it's okay. I will, uh, I will disactivate my microphone, okay? Okay. Okay, it's good. I'm not looking at the phone. Is the photo loading? Yes. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Can you see us? Can you see our presentation? Not yet. Can you see our presentation? Okay, can can it start? Okay. Hear us? Can we start? Okay. 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 So we're going to start. So please. Uh, here you can see Ukrainian Svanka of, of uh, different regions. Uh -huh. uh, the is one of the oldest forms of decoration. Vashvanka is used as a talisman to protect the person wearing it. Uh, people wear Vashvanka for holiday. As some people wear them every day and they have special Vishwanka for holiday. The Vishwanka has become a symbol of Ukrainian national uh, identity. Today people decorate uh, not only shirts uh, but also uh, other clothes like blouses, uh, t-shirts um, and uh, Swim. Swim. Today, Vishwanka are very popular. Uh, food is an important part of Ukrainian culture. Um, Ukrainian has developed over many centuries. And, uh, Ukrainian cuisine was mainly based on the products obtained from farming. Mm -hmm. uh, here you can see our national food called borscht. It is a cabbage and beet based soup, uh, usually with pork and meat. Here you can See, it is a cabbage roll stuffed with rice and meat. Uh, large stuffed dumplings can be stuffed with everything you like, like potatoes, cottage cheese, meat. See, pampushke. It is small bread, often buttered with garlic and dill. It is. Very thin. Yes, and Halina. You want to sing the song? That usually are stuffed with cottage cheese. Yes. 
So for that, okay. it is a, a meat prepared with garlic, onion, and black pepper. And the salo, it, it is the most important one. It is salted pork fat with or without garlic pepper. Uh, many of Ukrainian ethnic groups living within Ukraine have their own unique musical traditions, which are, are very different. Uh, the most striking general characteristic of uh, authentic, authentic uh, ethnic Ukrainian folk music is uh, the wide use of, of minor modes. Uh, Special songs of Ukraine are frequent, frequently in recitative style, essentially monodic. For example, uh, you may heard Shedrivka called Shedrik, uh, known in the West as uh, Carol of the Bell. Uh, the bulk of Ukrainian Folk songs melodies are based on scales identical to medieval modes, but differ in melodic structure. U Ukraine's music uh, exhibits uh, a wide variety of forms. Monodic, uh, heterophonic, homophonic, harmonic, yes, and polyphonic. And folk, solo singing yes, style we, can be divided uh, present, uh, into a number of a broad uh, aesthetic categories. Uh, solo singing is primarily ritual okay. song, including a uh, Hosenia, um, which is sung at waves. Um, uh, so, so there is solo singing with instrumental accompaniment of the okay, bandula, uh, kobza, or lira, by professional singers known as kobzari. Or a uh, uh, The highest form of development of uh, this style of singing uh, can be a lyric historical aspects uh, known as doom. Okay. Uh, 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 here you can see the tradition. Ukrainian uh, music instrument, which is called or Lut, Bandura, Vasoya, it's uh, three strings, Hello, Timbale, Kilka, or Dutch. Uh, we needed to have uh, only one microphone open uh, every time. And uh, also uh, in Ukraine, uh, there are many uh, uh, exciting, only three students. Uh, interesting uh, the others are that's in for example, an education for, for the job. Uh, 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 and uh, Uh, so let's talk about art. Um, the Ukrainian nation is really talented. Ukrainians have created many music interests. Thank you. Uh, 
Thank you. Because, uh, we could not uh, speak because uh, there was uh, feedback and uh, noise. Thank you very much. Uh, we are uh, not very well uh, prepared today because uh, the rest of uh, my class was uh, in a trip and uh, we have uh, stayed uh, here only three of us. I have uh, with me uh, Filipa, Angeliki and uh, Athena. Uh, we enjoyed your presentation very, very much. It was an excellent presentation. Bravo to Ukrainian team, a great team. Bravo. And uh, we saw that uh, we had uh, many things uh, in common. Uh, we also has, uh, have um, uh, co uh, like, uh, something like uh, kobza, kobza, the musical uh, instrument. Uh, it is a traditional uh, instrument in uh, Greece also. And uh, we have uh, many uh, food uh, like uh, your uh, food. I, I'm sure that uh, we would uh, we would feel very comfortable if uh, we, we were there with you. We would, could share the same uh, food. And um, as you know, uh, Greeks from uh, the ancient uh, times uh, were uh, travelers. Maybe you have uh, heard of uh, Ulysses. Uh, uh, who lived a uh, life uh, full of adventures and uh, that is why uh, we have uh, prepared uh, to present uh, a poem about uh, Ulysses and uh, his uh, journey back to Ithaca. This uh, poem is uh, from uh, one of our most uh, famous uh, poet, uh, poets, in Greek poets, He's uh, Konstantinos Kavafis, and uh, Geras uh, will uh, present this to you. Now, yes. As you set out for Ithaca, hope the voyage is a long one, full of adventure, full of discovery. Lesigonians and Cyclops, angry Poseidon, don't be afraid of them. You'll never find things like that on your way, as long as you keep your thoughts raised high. As long as a rare excitement stirs your spirit and your body, less Rigonians and Cyclops, wild Poseidon, you won't encounter them unless you bring them along inside your soul, unless your soul sets them up in front of you. Keep it like always in your mind. Arrive there is what you are destined for. But do not hurry the journey at all. Better if you don't over here. So you are off by the time you reach the island. While you with all you have gained in the way, not expecting Ithaca to make you rich. Ithaca gave you the marvelous journey. Without her, you would not have said out. She has nothing left to give you now. If you find her poor, Ithaca won't have fooled you. Why such you will have become? So full of experience, you will have understood by then. What the what did Lisa does me? Thank you very very much for uh, being here and uh, listening uh, to us. And uh, this is our presentation. Thank you. And uh, I think Imena, now we can uh, go on uh, with. Yeah, thank you. Thank you for pupils. So, uh, uh, our presentation, uh, my pupils' presentation. So, I will share uh, the screen uh, for you. Okay, so I have uh, two pupils to present uh, our story, our story about Tunisian festivals. We'll focus about festivals in Tunisia. Uh, so uh, uh, my pupils uh, Malik and Yasmin, uh, uh, they they have created uh, a story about Tunisian festivals. They will present uh, this uh, this story for you. Thank <laughs> you. 
Indonesian festivals. Hi, the story. Uh, we try to represent our festivals in a funny way. Hope you enjoy it. In Childopia, children worlds, uh, everything was just all right. They live in peace, and the tolerance seems to dominate all. No matter what the differences, they never mind. They only believe in love, no war, no hate and racism. They were just fine, living together. The king, the baby, the baby bus had strongly recommended on getting every country in, in, involved in the program. So they sent spaceship to bring children from the planet Earth to ensure that they are included in the child winning this time. This time they brought a group of kids from Tunisia. Therefore, they have to, to represent their, their country uh, by telling the, the judges about its traditions and its festivals to welcome uh, the Tunisian children in the list of citizens outside Tokyo. That's why the Tunisian kids had, uh, had chosen the most important festivals for, for them, which have a real intense on their faith and represent who they really are. They chose the Mawlid, Eid Adha and Eid Al-Fatah. Ali began uh, the Mulid. The Mulid Arabic, the birth of the Prophet, is the commemoration of the birth of the Prophet in Islam, Muhammad. Uh, it's celebrated on the 12th of Rabi' al Awal, the third month of the Muslim year. This event, which is today celebrated by many Muslim communities in the world, Tunisia, this day is also a holiday. A family meal in, is uh, prepared. For the occasion, pasty cream made from uh, alipo pine nuts called acid tzugu is prepared for the celebration. Then, Iman took the word talking about the Eid al Adha. Eid al Adha festival is a religious uh, festival celebrated by Muslims all over the world. It is when Muslims uh, sacrifice a goat, sheep, cow, or camel, sending part of the meat to poor people as a donation. It marks the end of, uh, of the uh, pilgrimage. Uh, for the uh, millions of mil Muslims who make uh, the trip to, make, to Mecca each year and, and pray five times a day. They, they like to tell Allah what, what they are thinking and hope for him to help them and remember Ibrahim and Ismail's uh, courage and devotion to God. Finally, Rami said, Eid al-Fitr, Fitr, Et la fête musulmane marquant la rupture du jeûne du mois de Ramadan. Uh, it celebrated the first day of the month Shawwal. It's uh, also uh, called Eid al uh, the little uh, festival. For uh, opposition, uh, Eid al the, uh, the big, the, la grande fête. During this, this festival, uh, Tunisians usually buy new clothes and toys for kids. They visit their relatives and celebrate it with them. The Jews were very uh, well, we're very impressed and agreed that Ali, Iman, and Rami were, uh, are welcome to Sheltopia. The people was very happy to have new citizens and were excited uh, to know more about their, their customs. Thank you. So, uh, uh, my students want to. Uh, to talk about your festival story, uh, I will just I will uh, stop uh, the sharing. Uh, so, so my pupils choose to to talk about uh, Tunisian festivals uh, as a story. Okay, uh, it's a very quickly story uh, about uh, Tunisian festivals. Uh, then, if you want, thank you. Yes. Okay. Uh, so, if you want, Halina, we are waiting for your song. Thank you, Atanasia. We are waiting for your song, if you want. Then uh, we will sing also, my pupils want to sing uh, for you a Tunisian song. I will deactivate my microphone. Yes. Yes.
Okay, can you hear us? I will uh, I will uh We uh, have not uh, prepared the song, but uh, Greeks uh, are uh, famous for uh, opa songs, <laughs> <laughs> uh, taberna songs, and uh, this is an old one. And uh, here we go. Apopsestis, agrojales, adilalun, niblopenes, era contamos filena dokis, que hasta ore a manzanera fis. Era contamos filena dokis, que hasta ore a manzanera fis. Y el anaño si por si ni doy, que hasta ore a un escrito proí. 
Ευχαριστούμε πάρα πάρα πολύ. Thank you very very much. Great Atanasia. So, great Ali Halina. Uh, my pupils will sing uh, their uh, song together. So. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you, Halina. Thank you, thank you, Atanasia. So uh, we are uh, in the end of, all, uh, of our live event. Thank you so much for your presence. I'm so uh, happy to see you again. Uh, I have another live event on 9 March with uh, Alina and uh, with other Tunisian partners. So uh, we are so glad to you join our next March event. Okay. Thank you so much. Bye bye. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Halina. Thank you, people. Bravo. Bravo. Bye. 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 Bye.